At Spiritec Laboratories, there is nothing that can't be achieved. Good day, everyone. I'm Seven Bomar, and I'm here to talk about Cymatic Studio Pro, a software that I created to allow you to go deeper into visual portals, meditative states by playing around with frequencies and patterns, harmonics and octaves. So this is a brief overview. The software itself is packed with features. So I'm going to go over a few and just let you know how it works and give you some ideas of what you're capable of doing uh, inside the software. So first and foremost, yeah, this is a software that puts in your hands the mathematical equations around creating patterns with frequencies and searching through overtones. And so in every way, uh, this is an experimental software. Uh, there's really no limits to what you can do with it. And what's under the hood is everything that's necessary for you to create uh, things like meta materials and to play around with resonance. So first and foremost, uh, there is an audio version of the program, of course, it is turned off, but I will let you see that here. So as we play, we can actually hear the frequency and then we can always oscillate through the frequency in real time. And then, of course, let's cut that off so you can hear me. If you wanted to just dial into a specific frequency, then you would just type that in here. And so we have two main modes, the interference and Shaladni. So we're just going to start with interference and just go through a few of these settings. So as you see, isolating uh, in a nutshell will isolate the pattern a bit more versus sometimes when you're working with certain patterns, you need to increase the amplitude, which basically increases the saturation of the pattern. So we'll just start with isolating. You also have every tone type. This is, uh, of course, square, soft tooth, triangle. All those tones are available here. And then you have some color screen schemes that you can oscillate through to change uh, the visual color, even scientific, which, of course, inverts it. You may be able to see that there. And then, of course, anything that you can create, you can also export in real time as a PNG with a transparent background. And you can also record it. As you can see, those settings are here on the right. Also, you'll find that you'll come into some pretty amazing stuff and you may have a little trouble getting back to that. So what we offer is the preset option. So you can save a preset at any point in time and then reload that preset. And that's going to be very useful, uh, especially for when you start coming into some of the more dynamic patterns um, and you start playing around with the settings here, such as the speed. You know, you can even turn the speed all the way down so that way it's frozen. You can use the freeze button to also stop the pattern altogether. And then you also have what you have is a pattern intensity. And so this allows you to make the pattern thinner or to make the pattern thicker, depending on, you know, what your desire is. And then you also have a zoom here where you can zoom out from the pattern, which allows you to visualize different aspects of the pattern. Uh, it can actually change the pattern altogether, and then you can kind of dial into some of those visual sweet spots. Um, as I said, you can strengthen those lines in order to get completely what you want to see. Uh, you can set your speeds really high. As you see, it will oscillate uh, through the actual visual pattern that is calibrated within the plate. And you can also even, again, set your zooms, your freezes on top of your patterns. And so let's just kind of put this in somewhat of a default state here and slow this down. And we will jump over to the Shaladni. But before we do that, I also wanted to mention that there is a help guide here. You can click on it and you can kind of scroll through and see what every setting does. Uh, there's also a way to change this into a square that does change how it exports also. And let's say when we jump into Shaladni, what we now are starting to work with is we're we're working with the waveforms. And so in this case, let's say as I slide through here, I'm going to be seeing different patterns at different frequencies under this Shaladi waveform. Let's just kind of jump back to the high order here. Let's zoom back in for all intents and purposes. And let's go ahead and bring our speed down and then let's go ahead and, and thicken our lines a little bit. Right. And so what this mode, again, as we talked about waveforms, meditative states, visual portals, this mode is really the best for that. Again, you can toggle through your colors. But as you see here, every time you move through what would be the mathematical calculations, what we're calling the mode numbers here, 
you can move from the second mode to the fundamentals to the first harmonics, etc. And as you see, you're going to get different visual patterns that correspond to each of those mathematical states. And you're also going to be able to continue oscillating through your frequencies as I'm doing here in the top left. I've oscillated into a different frequency and then I can thicken my lines in order to get a better visual of what I'm creating here, right? And then I could zoom in further, like if I zone into a pattern itself, let's go here uh, to the high order again. Um, let's try to get into one of these patterns here and let's you know just kind of play with the zoom a bit and then let's you know go back into the pattern intensity and cut that up a bit and let's go ahead and speed this up a little bit more and so what the experimentation process is really about is that oftentimes you will notice that within certain patterns that there are literally visual cues if you may um we're going to be continuously expanding the software anybody who does have the software uh for version one updates we'll be pushing those updates for free what we're doing is we're coming in and we're saying hey you know there's really a lot of potential here with what we call spiritual technology and our adaptation of continuously going forward with the cymatic project because we had the first cymatic software available on the web years ago and it was no longer functioning on pc this does function now on pc and mac and so this is a brand new updated version uh intuitive ui and we're putting all of the mathematical tools in your hands for you to jump in yourself and to begin to create these patterns create these shapes and really explore it further and see what it's capable of doing uh, let's just play around for a, a moment longer here Let's see if we can really get into one of those deep, complex patterns. I think I'm going to have to loosen this up just a little bit here. I'm going to have to speed this up so that we can see this, and I'm going to have to zoom in just a bit. Yep, and then probably going to need to bring the frequency down because when we start coming into those higher frequencies, we get less, what you would say is cohesion in certain ways and so as you see when we zoom in you know we get more visualization we come down that frequency we get different visualizations when we zoom in and zoom out we get different visualizations and then we have a couple other codes our goal was to launch you know a lot of times you know you're you're <laughs> going over the software over and over again and adding more features and you know it's been good enough and you know you just keep going that's just my fascination but i have a couple more renditions that i'm going to put into this that are going to introduce some other visual patterns uh and visual cues that you will find also very entertaining so links in the description if this is something that you're interested in of course we're available inside of support for anybody who may have additional questions about the software um, and yeah, we're just encouraging everybody to have some fun, play around with these waveforms, really see what overtones are capable of doing, understand resonance a bit more, even create some metamaterial patterns, start jumping into, you know, these other variables and really see what you can create. And as I said before, anything that you could create, you can export as a PNG with a transparent background or a recording or an SVG. All right. Wholeness and balance vibrations. You can trust everything we do is on the next level.